Legal disclaimer. Do not make this trade. Seriously, don't. This video is for educational purposes only and placed by a professional trader from Maverick Trading. Maverick Trading is sponsoring this trading experiment with a $100,000 trading account. To trade for Maverick Trading, you can submit an application for stock, option trader or currency trader from the link in the video description below. Welcome to trade number 60. We're getting up there in the numbers here. What are we doing on this 60th trade? We're trying to show that position management, that when you exit is possibly more important than when you enter. And we're going to do that by taking random trades using random methods and putting position management into play. I am still traveling in the amazing country of Australia. I'm currently in the Blue Mountains. If you want to do yourself a favor, look up Blue Mountains, Australia. Look at some pictures on Google. It is absolutely stunning. It's the Grand Canyon filled with jungle and with rainforest, waterfalls. It is absolutely amazing. Been doing lots of hiking down here. So since we're in Australia, let's make a trade directly on Australia. We're going to be looking at the Australia ETF, ticker symbol EWA. So here is the Australia ETF. Like everything, it's had a huge run since last November. It peaked out at the end of December. You can see we've been trending down a little bit, not too much. You can see here, if we take a look at where we are right here, right now. Remember, our criteria is this 13 EMA. If it's sloping upwards, we go long. If it's sloping downwards, we go short. It is sloping downwards. So this trade is going to be a short. Sorry, Australia, I love you, but the chart says to go short at the moment. Current price, 23.36. And current ATR is at 31 cents. So that is going to be our trade. We build 23.36 on the price and 31 on the ATR. It is February 15th for me. It is February 14th for everyone else back in North America. EWA is a symbol. We are going to be short 23.36. 31 cents is our ATR. So 2X ATR is going to give us our initial trailing stop at 23.98. The only thing we need to do is figure out our position sizing, and then we'll go ahead and make the trade. For our position sizing, let's check in on our count, get our count value. Let's first of all, just check in. We've got two positions here. Uh, we're getting pretty close to, be able to being able to move our stop on PIO. That was a trade we did for New Zealand. Uh, you can see we're almost at $1,000 of profit. So at $1,000 profit, we'll be able to tighten that up. And we've got an Aussie Kiwi trade, Forex trade that has been, again, this is a lower volatility trade. So I imagine we'll be in this one for a while. You can see it's down slightly. Let's check in on our count value. And right now we are at $100,818. So that is going to be the amount we use to determine our position size. So we put that number in here, 100,818. Our risk, 1%. Our entry was going to be 2336. Our stop was going to be 2398. We're just going to take out all these, make sure they're zeros, and hit calculate. And it's telling us we want to be short 1,627 shares. So that is the number. Let's go make the trade. Let's put in EWA. Remember, we're going to be short 1627 shares. So we're going to make sure to hit the sell button. 1627. We're going to put it slightly under the bid and ask. The reason I do that is just to give myself some time to uh, build this out. We can always adjust it later, but go ahead and attach the stop order. Again, our stop is going to be a trail. The trail is going to be times 31 times 2, so that's going to be 62. 62 cent trailing stop. Make sure that's good to canceled. That's a very easy common mistake to make. We're going to go ahead and hit submit. And let's see where we end up getting that fill. 
bill price was $23.34.4. So we're going to round that down. $23.34 is our actual fill price. Let's update everything and wrap this one up. Trade 60, EWA short, 1,627 shares. We got short. Our initial stop is already in there with our trailing stop. If it gets to 22.72, we're gonna tighten it up. If it gets to 22.10, we're gonna tighten it up a little bit more, just simply following the rules we've been following for 59 other times. Again, consistency is the key in trading. It's not how smart you are, it's how consistent you can be. I've seen traders make a lot of money in a short period of time, but if they weren't following defined set of rules, they don't keep it. You just don't keep the money you can do really good for a short period of time, but you don't keep it. To keep it, you have to be disciplined. You have to be robotic, especially on your position management. That is Trade 60. Goodbye, everyone.